<coughs> me, 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 me. I sound like I love Lucy. Me, me, me. <coughs> it's a great day in South Carolina. This is Karen with Xana Do Music. Welcome to my channel. I hope the fan isn't too distracting. My AC is not working. And it's in the morning, so it's not that hot yet. Oh, I need a hair color. Oh my goodness. Anyway, I have been dealing with the home warranty people in negotiations for two weeks. I, I'm not going to blame them for the negotiations because we are going through what we are going through. And I'm sure they are short of staff because everybody and Uncle Bob. Anybody heard the phrase Uncle Bob? I just recently heard it. I think it's like overseas kind of. Let's say. Anyway. I'm sure that they're understaffed. And I'm dealing with three different companies. The first company didn't turn it in quick enough. And then they took a while to make the decision. And it wasn't to my liking. So they sent another company out. And they sent it in. And now they're taking a while to make the decision. We make the decision, so two weeks, people, two weeks. I live in South Carolina, a subtropical climate. It doesn't, it hadn't been so bad last, this prior last week, it's been in the um, low 80s. And I do have an air conditioning use, a um, window unit in my bedroom, so I'm good. Anyway, I went to the Dollar Tree to buy one item, and I went down a rabbit hole. Before I go through all the Dollar Tree I'm the items that I got, and I'll tell you the one item when I come to it, because I don't see it right now because it's just piled up. I'm going to show you some of the free books I got. I got them at Second and Charles in the free bin, or I got them at the library. Our library is still closed, but they have curbside pickup. So if you order your book online, they'll pick it out, stick it on a shelf, and you come and get it. Anyway, I've read this book before. I think I want to reread the series because um, not the author continued the series because he's passed away, but another person has continued it on. It's like a Dutch series, maybe. And it's the girl with the rat, the girl with the dragon tattoo. I read his original series. I haven't read the continuation. I think that was. Second Charles. I don't remember most of these. And then I got a Judy Bloom book starring Sally J. Friedman as a cell. And then I got a sticker that's supposed to be not on there. May Binchy. This is the year it will be different. I read a few of her books. Then I got Caddy Woodlong as a, as a Caldecott winner I believe and then I got this one for junk journaling Tom Brown's field guide to wilderness survival and I just like the colors of the pages and there is some like, drawings and diagrams in there and then this one I believe came from the book yeah the library so let's get the library thing on it the wrinkled crown I think it just looks like something to read I definitely would read something like this I love young adult fiction and this was, um, it's called Dear Zoe. I think that this baby was born prematurely, and the grandfather was writing notes to it, to the baby, because he helped take care of her. And this one also came from Second Charles. It's from Stephanie Myers, and it's volume two of the graphic novel Twilight. Call oh, Ray, how about who you along? This graphic novel, and this is the second volume. That's for junk journaling. This one I am definitely keeping for myself because I love The Wizard of Oz. That's The Marvelous Land of Oz, and this one came from the library. The library. And, yeah, just, 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 let's see. Another kind of graphic novel kind of book. This one came from Second Charles. I think you could get these at Dollar Tree. I don't know, but they were free. It was a Harry Potter. I got him for the picture. Actually, it's, um, hold on just a moment. Harry Potter's on the outside or inside. 
And then you flip it over. It's the um, Fantastic Beast. What is the last movie coming out of this? They already did the Star Wars and the, all three of the Star Wars, and they were running close together, the first two. Anyway, that was it for the free books. And, oh, I, I forgot to mention that this was one of those sticker type books where you um, fill in the stickers, but I wanted it for the pictures. So I might do, you know, something fun with a Harry Potter themed. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, moving on to the Dollar Tree. I got these ribbons. One's blue, one's um, lace. We've all seen these. I'm not sure if I have anything new. I don't think I do. I bought these. I'm thinking I bought these because I wanted to do a, um, an autograph book. I think that was my thinking. I just don't remember. I got Mickey and Minnie. They were going to be danglies from it. My autograph books, when I mean autograph books, I mean when you take them to Disney World. And the way I'm going to do them is you're not going to take the whole book with you. you there's going to be sections. Like if you go to the four parks, you there will be four sections and you can pull out sections. Section 1, take it to the Magic Kingdom. Pull out Section 2, take it to Epcot. So you won't be carrying this big, chunky thing with you and get it ruined. I saw this one lady do this absolutely beautiful um, autograph book. And she got all the characters. And I'm like, what? Pictures. And then she gets the autograph. I'm like, why would you go through so much trouble when there's no way you can get all those autographs? There's just no way to do it. And then you're going to have some blank pages. But her, her book was awesome, by the way. So, I, I think there's, there's Buzz Lightyear somewhere in here. Um, this should not be in here. <laughs> this is a doc. This is Walmart. Here's another one. I got these on clearance. They were like 90 cents for a pack of four. I don't know why they're in here. I think I was just grabbing stuff. I bought some from the Dollar Tree. These are what I'm using for the autograph books. So you can take this into this part instead of all of this, and this could be your whole trip. Um, oh, let me let me just compare the Dollar Trees versus the um, WalMarts. This is Dollar Tree, and it holds 48 pictures, and it has it doesn't say how many pages, and this one only holds 24 pages. So, this, the Dollar Tree is actually the better buy, even though they're the same price, except for if you get it on clearance. Uh, here's Buzz Lightyear. Hello, Buzz. And let's see, I got some fabric. I, my, my stores usually don't carry the fabric, but I lucked up. I got two of the lemons, prints. I got one of the red and white gingham. I got one that I will call the Golden Girl Look, you know, Blanche Devereaux's bedroom. And then I got a strawberry. And then I really like buying the Cascade Pods there, or I actually buy the other ones too. They just, whichever they have. And I don't do um, my dishes, but like twice a week. So this is plenty for um, two weeks. It could even last me a month. It depends on... Sometimes I do it once a week. Then I bought this cotton twine. Please tell me, can I cook with this? I think I can. I need to find baker's twine, like real baker's twine, not decorative baker's twine. Because I got a rotisserie for my birthday. Not a rotisserie. I got an air fryer that has a rotisserie, and I can't find baker's twine. And I think baker's twine is just cotton twine. And this is what this is, is cotton twine. Anyway, the reason I bought this wasn't to bake with it, was for junk journaling and bookmaking. And then I bought um, some, well, this is not new. I don't know why I have this guy here. Well, anyway, tape. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what my thinking is, people. Then I got this. This is really cute. This is a, um, holds up the four by six size cards. And they had two options. I think they had a stripe one and they had the same colors. So that'd be fun if you do um, iCADS, which is index card a day, and you, you know, you, the arts in it. And I got a toothbrush, okay. And let's see, I got some of these 
The reason I got these is for my closet because I haven't been going to work in my um, rollers at work. And I have dogs that shed constantly. But this is not Dollar Tree, by the way, so don't go, oh, you guys have the Dollar Tree. No, I got this at Walmart for $5. I think it was five. And was it four, four ninety-seven? I don't remember. I think it, I got that. I'm going to hang these on the shelf. I hope this works. It should. It looks like it will. That's why I got these. I'm going to hang them on the wall so I don't lose them. Oh, and a tip that I like to do is I save my cover and I put it back on so um, you won't have it in exposed. Tape. I got a loofah. We're just supposed to change those out. I got these two bags to make bag art. Do you know are they pretty ones? Hummingbirds. And the other one's just a floral. And they come in a 10 piece. And they are the spring fling. Let's see, I got three of these fabs. I like the fab laundry detergent. And this is the um, Spring Magic, you get 40 ounces, and yep, just, just fab. Then I got these. I got six of these, and it's not my idea. I think it might have been, um, somebody over 50? Yeah, I don't remember. What I do is I take these, and I zip tie them three ways this way. And then I take, do two sets of three this way, and then I, um, put the other three to this way and these then I get these baskets to go with them and these baskets come in two different blues and I think I got the wrong blue but I'm okay with it because I already have another um, set up like this in my pantry this is for my pantry by the way so I um I think I got the deeper blue and this is the brighter blue and this and it goes this fits well it does it fits under there it does Maybe it's this way. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. This is it. I got it. I got it. I got it, people. It goes like this. And then you could put one on top. Like this. So you'll have double. And you um you just keep adding on how how wide your um drawers are. So, or your shelf is. So if your shelf can hold four of these then put four of these in and just keep going but yeah that's that's how it does it and it slides in and out very easily it doesn't have any resistance whatsoever because resistance is not futile in my pantry <laughs> star trek my sisters are star trek -y. i'm more of a star wars but i'm not i'm not, I'm not a huge huge like die hard fan but i, I like it better and I brought two of these. I had a plan, and I also don't remember the plan. The page protectors. I think I was gonna um, print out some printables because I had the instant ink, and I don't want to waste some of my um, prints that I have because you pay like three dollars and you get fifty a month. So I thought I'd do some printables and stick it in there. And this is to go with those um, little figurines that I just showed you. These. I think this is the cover that I wanted to do, the, the Mickey. And this is the cover I wanted to do with the um, Buzz Lightyear. And the um, Toy Story, not Buzz Lightyear. Okay. Um, I, I don't know why the bubble wrap in there. To go along with that, I got a deck of Toy Story cards. And a deck of Disney cards. And to go with um, just my Disney collection. I got these two stickers. You get, I think it's 96 pieces in each one of them. I got this plate. And I wanted to deck a pot in the back of it, you know, like old school, back in the 80s or 70s. Um, I, I paused because I was remembering a memory when I was at the Dollar Tree. I had um, picked something up, and you know how the, the buggies are slanted? And I guess this is, it isn't funny, but it kind of is because the lady actually laughed about it and she was the one that had to clean it up, unfortunately. I was moving it out and the plate rolled right out of the buggy into that slit and went, crash! And the whole entire store heard it. I didn't drop it, it just rolled right out of the buggy. 
Because it was like this. Oh, woo! Anyway, she thought it was pretty funny. Here's the item I went in for. The four-piece little, um, what do you call these things? Bowls. Ah! No, the, the, um, ramekins. I wanted ramekins. Walmart had them for $2 a piece. I didn't want to pay $2 a piece. I knew, um, Dollar Tree had some. The plastic ones you couldn't stick in the, um, dishwasher. It didn't say anything about the microwave. So if you couldn't stick in the dishwasher, I knew you couldn't stick in the microwave. So I didn't get it. Then I saw these and I'm like, oh, cool. And then I got funny about that at the end, so stay tuned. And then I like to buy these litter boxes. Because I like to throw these litter boxes away. Because my cat can blow up a litter box. So I bought four of them. They last about two months, and then I throw them away. So they don't have to smell the stank anymore. And then I got the brown um, twine for art making. And then I'm going to have to stretch. Come here. Come here. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What? Well, I can't this one. I got these pink balls. Balls. I saw somebody do this on um, YouTube. Her name is Carolyn Duby. Dubai. I can't remember her last name. She pushes them in and then she uses them as mark making tools for jelly plate. And here's some more of these that aren't what's supposed to be in there, the photo things. And here's the index cards that I was going to demonstrate with that envelope. I don't know where I put the envelope. Oh my goodness gracious, golly well, gee. Where did I put that envelope? Who am I? Who am I? Well, I'll just carry on. I got a roll of wrapping paper for um, journal making covers. It's just brown craft paper. Which you probably already have, but you know, you never have too much stuff, right? <laughs> oh my goodness. Where is the thing? Why am I still looking for it? I don't know. It's probably sitting right in front of me. I've been watching, playing June's Journey, and half of those things I can't find are right if it was a snake. Sometimes they are snakes. Ah, okay. Here it is. These, these fit in here. Pretty good. Alright, continuing on. I bought three of these. They had a fourth option. I think it was a unicorn. I didn't want the unicorn. I really didn't want the ice cream because I wanted more of these prints. But I didn't want to duplicate it, so I just got three. I, I am making a journal out of this. A, um, like a traveler's journal. And I'll show you the, what I'm going to use for a cover when I get to it. And then I bought four of these. I don't know why I needed four, but apparently I did. They would make great covers for traveler journals or whatever. This the um, twine binding for these, and these are three piece. Did I show you the pictures? You have to look super close. Can you see? Can you see? And I bought the three of these. They have three different kinds, so I bought all three. That's a fun one, and then there's the. Another fun print with swallows and slogs. The unicorns are all fun, I guess. But yet, yeah, if you check the size out, they're, they're very close to the, the, the um, size, so they make excellent covers for them. And then, I bought these paper pads. I bought two of this design. And they come 36 pieces, 6 sheets. Do you guys remember back in the day, they used to have paper kits, um, scrapbooking kits, and they actually had scrapbooks at the Dollar Tree. And I want to say it's, it was K-Studio or Catherine or something like that. I wish they would bring that back. Because it was pretty cool. You, get, you got a little sheet of stickers, you got a couple of 12 by 12 pieces of paper for a dollar. Then I found this book. It's called Crafted Up Around the World. So it's crafts for around the world, obviously. And it was by Libby Abdi. Abdi. And I don't know how much it was originally. Uh, it was originally $14.95 US. Then I got good housekeeping skillet suppers. 
It was, there's no price on it, what it originally was. Oh, here it is. I lied. $16.95. A good food guarantee. So I got that cookbook. Which is funny because I don't cook. So I've been using my air, I, air fryer. And I'm going to do a COVID-19 haul. That's embarrassing. Talk about rabbit hole going to Dollar Tree. OMG. It all started with um, Lolly Palooza. She's a YouTuber. And I'll try to remember to um, link Carol and du du Bois. I'm no Doobie. I know I'm sorry her name. And um, Lolly Palooza's um, channel's in the description box. She bought a Cricket Joy, and I thought I needed a Cricket Joy. And well, <laughs> oh my God, this is embarrassing. But it is kind of funny, and, and I'm really, there's one item that I got that I use the most, and it's something I never thought I wanted. So stay tuned for the COVID-19 haul. Okay. These, I didn't actually buy the, this haul, but I wanted to show it to you. My nephew's birthday was June, oh my gosh, this is embarrassing. It was um, last Monday, it wasn't this last Monday, it was the Monday before. And he, but he had a um, family birthday party, and I had bought um, Toy Story um, gift bags. But since there was only supposed to be like three kids, his sister and his sisters and one friend, I um, got them a bigger gift bag. And then my sister invited somebody else, so that ended up fourth kid. So I had to change the whole gift bags. I took the older ones out, gave it to the smaller one, and then so I have anyway. I have one left over. So I have the paints, and I got the stickers, and I've got the um, color forms. So I might use that with my um, my my autograph book. And then I got this historical document poster. I'm gonna put it in my office because our government needs to be reminded of the Bill of Rights. <laughs> anyway, I'm going in my office just to be. A little sarcastic. Then I got these, um, oh my goodness, brain freeze. I got these boxes, and these boxes aren't to be used as boxes. They're to be used for covers, for um, book making. And I got these file folders, and these file folders are to be used to cover for book making. That's why I got that craft paper, because I think it looks pretty good with this. What do you think? Okay. That's that's the whole reasoning behind this. Okay. And here is the um item the um book board, I guess. I won't call it book board for the lack of better terms. That I will be using for these. And it's this. I saw somebody else use this. I'm not going to um share her channel because I'm unhappy with her. The reason I am hooked unhappy for her with her is because she used to do these beautiful tutorials on how to do mini albums and she decided charging which is no big deal but in my opinion I think she should have left the ones that she had already uploaded on her channel as freebies and then started doing new ones and started charging but she didn't so all the people who were in the middle of doing her tutorials you know had to end up paying for it when it was originally free but this is what she used and as you can see, it fits. You can um, cut this with a um, paper trimmer. Just use a dull blade. And it's definitely enough for the whole entire book. You've got enough room for the spine and the cover. And it's pretty hard. Then I got some photo paper. And I actually like this photo paper. The reason I like it is because you can make no cards out of it. A lot of photo paper has the um, the logo of the company, such as Kodak, HP, Canon, Epson. Their logo is on the back of the paper. Even some generics do it, but but I know I think Walmart has one brand that doesn't. It might be Penny Gear now. Sam's has one brand that doesn't, but you're you're infinite unless you brave enough to open the stuff in the store. So here's the front side of the photo paper, and it's 
completely blank on the back side. And I don't have a um, Sam's cards. I heard that they're giving away free memberships to Sam's. I have to look into that. And then I got this. What size is it? Is it 11 by 14? Yeah, 11 by 14 paper poster board. This fits the frame, the 11 by 14 frame. So if you want to do something fun with the kids, I have a tutorial about doing hands for Mom Mother's Day. You can do that, and then you can stick in the and to the um, post and the to, to the frame so you just need the poster board and the frame and let the kids go crazy with their artwork and you got an art piece then i found a brand new uh, not a brand new a name brand set of batteries trip they had double a and triple a and i needed the triple a for the fan remote like that thing right there and it's, it's just a two pack and it's Energizer Max, and like I said, they had the double A, and they were two pack too. And this is the cover for those um, black neon um, notebooks. I wanted the blue, but I they didn't have blue, so maybe if I, in the future I will check if I haven't made this already. That is what I'm going to be using as the cover, and it's. Plenty of paper, as you can see, to cover this. And then where's that board? Where's that board? Where's the, oh, here it is. There's plenty of paper. Now, I'm going to be using this whole board, so plenty of paper. Then the last things, I got some glitter paper. I do not know why they don't tell you this, but this is adhesive glitter paper. And there's actually two kinds. I'm going to show you the first kind. Let me, let me sort it. Okay, and it, oh, they're there. The first kind, the only way you can tell the difference between them, the two is the look on the back is the same. And all three pieces are the same. Like a green, the purple, and the gold. And another clue is the seal is on the side. But yes, this is a piece of paper. I think, oh, uh, this one, I opened this one. This one is one of these. I did open it because I wanted to check to see if it's a piece of paper. Open it up. Okay. And pull out the paper. Throw the same sheets. And give me a second and I will see if I demonstrate it. I don't have, I see. It pulls apart and this is sticky. And here, stick, stick, stick. It doesn't say anywhere on the um, packaging that this is sticker paper. And I've seen other YouTubers haul this. But, but anyway, the other one is this pack. And the reason I noticed it was different is the gold was a little different color. Just a smidgen off and then. The, um, opening this right here and it's white in the back so instead of getting three of the same colors you're getting different colors and I open this up and I believe I believe I opened this up and check there it's a little well it's actually kind of sad you get a piece of plain board and then you get three different colors and I bought these mainly because of this black sheet there's a piece of tape on here. That's kind of weird. Let's see. Now, the question is, is this adhesive? And I think I checked too in the store. I might have, I would have left. No, I probably would have bought it because I wanted the black. Oh, give me a home. Well, oh, it's not, I thought I checked it. It's not peeling up. So maybe I have it wrong on this one. Maybe this one is an um, adhesive. Well, oops. I boo. I thought I checked it. Maybe I checked the wrong one. But no, this isn't adhesive. The ones with the um, solid, the three same colors are. I sworn I checked it. I could have sworn. Oh, wait, 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 wait. It is. Yeah, I was pulling the wrong. Yeah, it is. It is. 
It is. Now, I thought I checked it. I just pulled the um, second lane of the back in. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yep, 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 it is. <laughs> okay. 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 So, black, gold, and the purple. This one, I think, is two pinks and one gold. Yep. Nope, it's an orange. My bad. What do I think it was pink for? Yep, no, it's, it's an orange. And, I, and this one, I think, is the same as the first package. Yep. Yep, the same colors. And that is my haul. And, oh, I need to tell you the funny. Remember I went in to buy these? Well, I was putting my glasses away when I did the dishes because, you know, it's the time of the week. Uh, Ta-da! I already had them. Ah! And there's, um, <laughs> I, I had used one and I had three left. I know they're coming different labels. <laughs> yeah. So I can save myself a lot of money because this was nothing I needed except for maybe the this. Well, and the um the um soap for the dishwasher. Well, that's all, folks. If you have any questions, comments, and concerns, leave them in the question, comment, concern box. And until next time, stay calm and carry on. And maybe I'll get my hair done. Probably not, because I'm concentrating on getting my AC done. Oh, if they don't fix it, it's going to cost $2,500 because it needs an air compressor. Yeah. Ciao. Oh.